Introduction What shape does a loose thread make? What shape is a crescent moon? A curve in everyday usage means not straight. In mathematics, a curve can be straight also. A curve can cross itself or may not cross itself. If a curve does not cross itself, then it is called a simple curve. Objectives At the end of this lesson you will be able to Define curve Describe polygon and its sides, vertices and diagonals Define and explain circles and parts of a circle Look at the two figures drawn by Sam In the first curve, it starts from a point and finishes at another point but in second curve it starts and finishes at the same point the first type of curve is called open curve while the latter is known as closed curve Here you see a moving ant. With the reference to a closed curve at position A, the ant is at exterior or outside of the curve. At position B, it is on the boundary or on the curve. At position C, the ant is at interior or inside of the curve. These figures displayed on a screen are closed curves. Each of these curves have different shapes. First four curves are made up of straight lines and are called polygons. A figure is a polygon if it is a simple closed figure made up of line segments. The line segments AB, BC, CD, DE and EA form the polygon ABCDE. These are the sides of polygon. Any two sides with common endpoints are called adjacent sides. For example, AB and BC, BC and CD, CD and DE, DE and EA are adjacent sides. The meeting point of a pair of sides is called its vertices. Here, A, B, C, D and E are the vertices of given polygon. The end points of the same side of polygons are called adjacent vertices. For example, A and B, B and C C and D, D and E, E and A are adjacent vertices. Line segment joining non-adjacent vertices are called diagonals of the polygon. For example, AC, AD, BD, BE, CE are diagonals of the given polygon. An angle is not a closed figure. A closed figure with least number of sides is a triangle. A triangle has three sides, three vertices and three angles. In the given figure, ABC is a triangle. AB, BC and CA are three sides. A, B and C are three vertices. Three angles are angles CAB, ABC and BCA. The page of a book is called 
a quadrilateral. It has four sides, four vertices and four angles. In quadrilateral ABCD, four sides are AB, BC, CD and DA. Side AB and BC, BC and CD, CD and DA are adjacent sides. AB and DC, BC and AD are opposite sides. The four vertices of quadrilateral ABCD are A, B, C and D. Among them A and C, B and D are opposite vertices. The four angles of a quadrilateral are angle DAC, angle ABC, angle BCD and angle CDA. Let us study one more shape. This is a circle. It is a simple closed curve which is not a polygon. Every point in circle is at equal distance from the center. A line segment joining the center of a circle to any point on the circle is called a radius of that circle. And a line segment passing through the center of circle and joining any two points on it is called a diameter of that circle. There can be infinite number of radius for a given circle. Similarly, there are infinite numbers of diameter for a circle. The line connecting two points on circle is called. Like any other close figure, a circle has interior and exterior region. The region inside a circle can be bounded by two radii and arc of circle. The region is called sector of the circle. Similarly, there is a portion bounded by chord and arc of circle which is called segment of the circle. The boundary of a circle is known as circumference of the circle. The distance around a circle is its circumference. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. A simple curve is the one that does not cross itself. A curve is said to be closed if its ends are joined. Otherwise, it is said to be open. A polygon is a simple closed curve made up of line segments. Triangle and quadrilaterals are polygons made of three and four sides respectively. A circle is the path of a point moving at the same distance from a fixed point.